Rob was a man who went to Africa afraid of death and came back from Africa completely terrified of death. I think I knew it was bad and the fire was starting to come up and I, I was just trying to get a seatbelt on for everything I had because I knew if I can get a seatbelt on, I can grab him, I can pull him. I almost had him and I, I, I couldn't save him. It was, that, that's, that's been a moment that has driven the rest of my life. He was dealing with his PTSD by basically locking into something that was taking every inch of his attention span and his motivation and, and pushing it into a digital realm. It was the ultimate form of escapism, the most damaging kind of escapism. And then Ryan saw all the things that I was going through and was trying to plant some seeds that were like positive rather than modern warfare. And he put a paintbrush in my hand and that crazy raw brain got the idea, we're painting now, we're gonna be a painter. And I don't know what that means, but we're gonna do it. Within six months of that, my whole house was covered in just everything. Like there was murals on every wall. I was just painting. If there was a blank surface, I was gonna put something on it. Eventually that just wasn't enough. And we had to claim the yard. This is his rebellion against the rest of the little houses that are all painted exactly the same and are all fenced exactly the same. And here's Thunderdome. Here's just a one little speck of bright rebellion where we're saying, no, we're making a carnival and we're gonna have 30 guys fight in it. I look back on my life and it's been a series of ups and downs. And I wish I could go back and have a conversation with my 22 year old self and just shake him and be like, there's so much more you can live for. There's a different way to live. And even as children, like we all have that dream to like, like playing with Nerf guns, like I'm one of these days I'm gonna like make a giant Nerf course and then just like dies out. The difference isn't that Nerf is for kids, it's that it's okay for you to be a kid. What you do right now matters on a Tuesday in Springfield, Missouri. What you do right now matters in Africa is a plane crash, is is on fire and people need to be helped. We're all a bunch of weird people in our own way as far as society is concerned and we, we bond over that a whole lot. And maybe everyone who comes to Thunderdome, maybe I can change their life in a small way. And I can create the world that I want to create in my own backyard.